briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a fascinating legal case, attorneys found themselves incarcerated for refusing to disclose the source of funds for their fees, a move they took while defending their clients facing drug-related charges. The case, United States v. Anderson, was judged by the United States Court of Appeals for the Tenth Circuit in 1990. The heart of the issue revolved around whether the lawyers were under obligation to reveal this fee information and if the sacred concept of attorney-client privilege offered protection. This legal tangle started when the grand jury commenced an investigation in April 1989 into James Cole Tharp, suspected of illegal activities related to drugs. The lawyers involved were representing four defendants believed to be associated with Cold Harp's operation. In their search for information, the grand jury issued subpoenas in October 1989 to the attorneys, seeking details about their fees. On finding their motions to annul the subpoenas ignored, the attorneys chose to resist. They appeared before the grand jury in December 1989 but flatly refused to provide evidence or proffer the requested documents. As a result, they were held in contempt of court and immediately sent to jail. Following this unexpected turn of events, the attorneys rapidly filed an emergency appeal that successfully led to their release pending a final decision. Contesting their charges of contempt, the attorneys argued the attorney-client privilege protected them from revealing the source of their fees and that disclosing this would violate their client's Sixth Amendment rights. They further argued that their due process rights had been infringed upon through the trial court's proceedings and their initial denial of bail while awaiting appeal. Following a thorough review, the court reached a definitive ruling. Attorneys must generally disclose fee information unless disclosing this would expose confidential exchanges between the attorney and client. This distinct proviso, now left to the lower court's discretion, significantly modifies the general rule. The court found no breach of the Sixth Amendment and ruled the proceedings fair. However, it referred the topic of the confidentiality contained in the fee contracts back to the district court for further examination. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.